Crickets. It's really hot tonight. I'm in the garage now. Just gonna get some dinner, if you can call pizza dinner, I suppose. Um, Hubby just quit his job today. Well, he didn't quit today, but he had his last day at work today. And he has a new job on Monday, but he has a stupid busy day today. So something easy for tonight. The little one is being read to right now. And... I'm just heading off to IGA to get us a little dinner thing, pizza. Yep, so let's do that. The pizzas are in and now we're gonna go back to the desk to um, find my messy desk. <laughs> uh. It's been raining all day today and it is quarter to five right now. I'm making lasagna. Who? Sauces, lasagna sheets. 
whatever it might be. San Remo. And the oven is on because husband is home late today because he's got the first day of his new job. And Lily is crafting right over there. Can you say hi and wave? <laughs> um, so I'm picking up Lee very soon from the train station and um, I hope before I do I can put the lasagna in the oven. Go on, bounce, bounce. Okay, bounce. We are at something that's called Benyab Local. Lily, can you come this way, please, sweetie pie? The animals are there. Here's my little cutie pie. The emus chasing each other. Lily, come this way, please, sweetie pie. Come on. There's some picnic tables there. It's at a main road, and this is a massive mansion. But yeah, when you're local, you can get cakes and coffees and stuff. What's in there? What cookie did you get? Did we get a red velvet cookie? Yeah. That's Yum. <laughs> oh. Yum. Yum. Does it taste good? The flies are absolutely horrible. And we're gonna see the animals in a moment, right? After the cookie, yeah? <laughs> There's a friendly little goat. Well, he's not that little, but... Come on, Goose. Have a look at the animal. Came here for the animals and she's ending up in a sand pit, right? just received a parcel and it is my new XP pen tablet so ee, I'm very excited to open it um let's just do it together okay shall we I got the innovator 16 uh, anniversary edition so you get a bunch of extras like the stand and uh, a glove and stickers and a few extra other bits and bobs um, so um, let's open it shall we okay so let's move all this stuff out of the way because we don't need that right now this by the way is my um, palette with my high-end watercolors and I put pixie sticks her stickers on there and they're absolutely fantastic there's no way they're gonna come off anytime soon so that's what I did with that. Let's 
turn on some light. Boop. Hello, light. XP pen. Drawing different. Um, let's open it this way, otherwise you'll see my address. Oh. Empty? Yes, you're empty now. Yay, another box for crafting. Comes with these. I think these are the nibs. So I ordered a hundred extra nibs for 15 bucks. Which is really cool. So Innovator 16, they their 15th anniversary edition. Let's see what's in this thing. I like the matte box. Yeah. Ooh, it's massive! Look at it! This is the Wacom. So it's not that much bigger, but it is definitely bigger by that much. Um, this is about A4, I think. So this thing is A4. So yeah, it's an A4. So the XP one is bigger and cheaper. And it has a screen as well. So uh, that is that. That's to pull it out. So let's put this thing on the side. And uh, maybe on this side. It's heavy. It's really heavy. Let's see what else is in there. Oh. That's the stand. So normally you have to buy the stand separately. Does this work? I'll figure it out later. It has eight penny nibs in it. Right there. So that's the nib. And then in here we have the pen. That's the pen that comes with it. Sleek design. And the one that we need for Australia is this one. There we go. That's the whole thing. Ah, this is where the goodies are. All right, that's empty now. So that's the cable that comes with it. The quick guide, the glove, warranty and thank you. Stickers, I'll and postcards, I'll go over them in a moment. A keychain, a normal writing pen, and a cleaning cloth, which is nice. And then here we have the actually metallic sheen of their mascot as well. It's really cool. The different places in the world. Oh, really sweet. And then here we have. Oh, and here we have. Okay, so his name is Phoenix. Oh, I like that packaging that it just opens like that. I keep that in mind. Come on, 
cam. There we go. They are really sweet stickers. So yeah, that is everything that comes in the um, 15th anniversary edition of the XP Pen Innovator 16. I'm not sponsored, not affiliated. This is just my own purchase. And uh, yeah, I think it's really, really neat. Me? <laughs> you wanna cry to mommy? You wanna cry to mommy? Mommy's just gonna tidy up a little bit. You've got plenty of crafting stuff on your little table. But this room is an uh, absolute disaster. Three parcels that I need to send to friends. That is my <clears throat> um, cardboard paper egg carton pile. I think I can condense it a little bit. Maybe flattening boxes. Perhaps, maybe. Hagrid's had to sit up there. Gonna take that to the library tomorrow because they have a Harry Potter thing going on. Uh, and these are just all my supplies, I suppose. And then the desk looks like a little mess. This is lunch leftovers. This is the cathartic box that I'm working on, working with some watercolor stuff in my Arteza sketchbook. Um, research is the Harry Potter creatures. We have that with the Hemi gouache or Ar Artex gouache. Then Katie sent me something which is Katie from Katie Riles Art. Derwent ink tanks in ink tense sticks <laughs> and I want to make a painting with that Arteza gouache eh. that's the swatch sheet it looks way brighter on screen than what it really is but they are very muted colors and I absolutely love them this is way more red than um, than in real life but I really really like these colors and their coverage is really really good so this swatch is for that and I filmed that as well but then obviously I need to make some art with that and I want to use that same book for that. Next year I want to do some um, products like prints and um, stickers, <laughs> sticker sheets. So what I was thinking is just um, putting them in brown paper bags to save the environment and also perhaps wrap some old dictionary papers around them and then sealing that with wax so old dictionary papers and sealing them with wax and a ribbon which looks aesthetically pleasing and it, it helps the environment plus you get to keep the wrap because you can take that off the paper and it doesn't damage the packaging what are you looking for You don't think you have enough supplies here on your desk? Yeah, I got to grab clay. We've moved from art supplies to clay. So I'm just going to tidy up a little bit, beautiful hair, flyaways, and um, I'll let you watch what I'm doing.
14th of November. It's the evening. It's quarter past eight or 20 past eight. And I am working on some journals. And this is not for my main channel. This is for my second channel, which you are watching right now. <laughs> um, but I have been kind of, well, not in a rut. I've just been feeling, eh. I don't want to work on anything miniature related right now. So I'm just going to work on a journal. And the miniatures can come tomorrow again. This is my desk right now. It's a big mess. Well, it's it's an organized mess. So, uh, yeah. This is the fairy journal. I'm holding a very hot iron. Because I am ironing the fabrics that are going on the front and back. If you don't mind, I will put the top-down camera on and I'll bring you along on how I make them.